Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. So in this video, I'll tell you how to fix iPhone cannot connect to App Store error. So eager to download your favorite app and boom, your iPhone cannot connect to App Store. Does this scenario ring a bell like you? We are sure that many other users have also been victims of such messy situations, no matter what the problem is. Rest assured, there are solutions. In this video, I have solutions for you that could potentially fix the problem when iPhone cannot connect to App Store after iOS 17 update. First, subscribe to my channel for more upcoming videos and hit the like button. So let's start the video without wasting any time. So the first step is make sure it's a user end problem. First of all, you will want to make sure the problem is on your end and not a wider problem with Apple. The best way to do so is to visit Apple system status page to see if the app store is down. If the problem is on the Apple side, then you will need to wait to for Apple to fix it and you are done. And the next step is restart the app store app. Sometimes a simple force close it is all you need. You can do this by simply swiping up from the bottom of the screen and then swiping up on the app switcher. After you quit the app, check your device can now connect to app store. The next step is toggle airplane mode on and off. For this, go to settings and then tap on airplane mode toggle button to enable it. Wait for some time and then tap on it again to disable it. You can also done this step by open the control center screen from the top right side and then just tap on the airplane icon to enable it and then again tap on it to disable the airplane mode and you are done. And the next step is toggle Wi-Fi off and on. For this, go to settings and then tap on Wi-Fi and then tap on Wi-Fi toggle button to turn it off. Next, wait for some time and then tap on its toggle button to turn on again and you are done. And the next step is to start your iPhone. It's simple but turning your iPhone off and back on can solve hidden software issues. For this, go to settings, scroll down and then tap on general. Scroll down to the bottom, next tap on shutdown and then slide to power off. Wait for some time and then press the power button until you see the Apple logo on your home screen and you are done. And the next step is check your date and time settings. Out of sync date and time settings can cause all sorts of different problems. It's possible your iOS device thinks it's stuck in the past or the future, which could be preventing from connecting to the app store. For this, go to settings, scroll down and then tap on general and then tap on date and time. Toggle the set automatically, toggle to get your time from the internet and you are done. And the next step is disable your VPN. For this, go to settings. Scroll down and then tap on general. Scroll down to the bottom and then tap on VPN and device management. Next tap on VPN and then tap on status toggle button to turn it off and you are done. And the next step is update iOS. For this go to settings. Scroll down and then tap on general and then tap on software update. Wait until the page is loading. See if the update is available then tap on update now and update the latest version of iOS and you are done. And the next step is reset all iPhone settings. For this, go to settings, scroll down, tap on general, scroll down to the bottom and then tap on transfer reset iPhone. Next, tap on reset and then tap on reset all settings. It might ask you to enter your passcode. So enter your passcode and follow the on-screen instruction to reset all settings on your iPhone and you are done. I hope this solution will fix your issue of iPhone cannot connect to App Store error. And also let us know in the comments below if you have any questions. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.